Spanish 1, Global Challenges, Vocab 26 through 31. I'm going to say each of these words in English, then Spanish, and then clap. And I'd like you guys to repeat the word with me, or the phrase with me, okay? 26. It's cloudy. Está nublado. It's cloudy. Está nublado. <coughs> Sorry. 27. It is warm. Hace calentito. It is warm. Hace calentito. 28. It is cool. Hace fresco. It is cool. Hace fresco. 29. Temperature. Temperatura. Temperature. Temperatura. <coughs> and 30. Weather. Tiempo. Weather. Tiempo. And finally, 31. Storm. Tormenta. Storm. Tormenta. Huh. I just realized I have six items in this list instead of five. Oops. <laughs> Sorry, I hope that doesn't confuse or traumatize anyone. All right, now how are we going to remember that cloudy is nublado? Well, you might have heard the comment, uh, she made a nebulous remark, or he asked a nebulous question. Your English teacher might say that was a nebulous response. Nebulous means murky, unclear, or cloud-like. So if nebulous is cloud-like, está nublado is cloudy. If you're not familiar with the word nebulous, uh, you might have heard of a star nebula or a cloud nebula. If you look through a telescope and you see lots and lots of stars all close together and it looks like it's a big cloud and so scientists call it a cloud nebula or a star nebula okay now early on in the year we learned that hace calor is it's hot well hace calentito is it's warm remember we joked about is it hot in California or what well ito means little Taco is a taco, a taquito is a little taco, libro is book, a librito is a little book. So if it's a little bit hot, it's warm. Hace color, it's hot. Hace calentito, it's warm. We learned earlier in the year that hace frío is cold. We talked about a freezer is cold. I'm freezing, or it's frigid, or freon gas is an inner inert atmospheric gas and it's really cold. So, hace frío is it's cold. Hace fresco is it's cool. You know, there's a soft drink here in America called Fresca. And I guess it's okay to drink it at room temperature, but it's better if it's cool. So, fresco, hace fresco is it's cool. You're not going to miss temperature, temperatura. It's just add an A. Now, hold it, Mr. Hull. I thought tiempo meant time. Mucho tiempo, much time. Uh, a tiempo, on time. Well, tiempo means time and it also means weather. You might remember the phrase, what's the weather like today? Que tiempo hace hoy? What's the weather like today? Que tiempo hace hoy? Que tiempo hace hoy literally means what weather is he making today? Remember I said Spanish is based on uh, religion? Even with weather, it's religion. He or God is making it hot. He or God is making it cold. Well, how do I know if tiempo is time or weather? Context. You have to use context. Storm is tormenta. Here's the way I remembered it. Um, the storm tore through the town and afterwards all the men had to help clean up. The storm tore through the town and all of the men had to help clean up afterwards. I guess women and kids could help too. Also, the storm was terrible. We were in torment as the storm ripped through our community. All right, let's do a little post quiz here. I'm gonna cover up the Spanish. Please look at the English and say the Spanish equivalent out loud or even better, look at the English and write the Spanish equivalent down on a piece of paper. This has been Spanish 1, Global Challenges 26 through 31. Not 26 through 30. <laughs> uh, okay.